Luckily for me, all the AI speakers before me have spoken about the data challenge that they face uh, prepping their data before they can run the algorithms. Uh, that's what we do at iMerit. Uh, we do digital data services uh, at scale for companies that are doing analytics, machine learning, and computer vision. But that's not really what's fun about our company. What's really fun about iMerit is over 80% of our employees come from really poor, under-resourced backgrounds. Uh, they come from family average incomes of less than 7,000 rupees a month. Six months before they joined our company, they've never touched a computer or a smartphone, even though they might have 10th or 12th standard education backgrounds. Just to make it a little harder, uh, our operations are in states like Jharkhand, we have a center in Ranchi, in West Bengal, and in Orissa. So we truly are a for-profit social impact enterprise. 55% of our team are women, and many of them didn't even have bank accounts before uh, they came to work with us. So what do they do? They wake up every morning, they walk into an iMerit office, and suddenly, like a Bollywood dream sequence, they're transformed into participants in this world where they work on image tagging for self-driving cars, image segmentation for virtual and augmented reality, cancer cell categorization for medical diagnosis, natural language tagging for speech and language recognition, and fintech. And uh, I think this, for us, is very indicative of what is the potential of people from very humble backgrounds. In an ironic way, these technologies which are supposed to eliminate humans are actually being trained by humans and driven by humans. And on the flip side, these livelihoods did not exist 10 years back. These are being created by the machine learning economy and the computer vision economy that everyone's talked about. So how do we get them to do this work? Um, basically, first and foremost, you have to take a leap of faith. You have to go past these gated ways of thinking about what people are capable of doing based on what their origins are. You have to provide context, and uh, that allows them to learn new skills constantly. And you have to also encourage them to be relearning, often within cycles of one or two weeks, as your customers iterate really fast on their innovation technologies. So uh, I would just leave you with this, that you should push past your skepticism of uh, what human potential is, and uh, actually believe that people from very humble backgrounds can participate in tomorrow's data economy. And the impact we see is phenomenal. We are at over 1,000 employees. I want to leave you with my favorite quote from uh, the movie Ratatouille, Pixar's animated film. It says, not everyone can be a great artist, but a great artist can come from anywhere. And I think that's also true of our employees at Imerit. Thank you.